What are you talking to me for? <laughs> Trust me, I'm not the kind of guy you want to get involved with. If you spend too much time around me, you're gonna get hurt. I'm not just saying that, you know. I'm serious. I pissed off some pretty nasty guys. And every day, they wait outside the school gate for me to show up so they can beat me senseless. If they see me and you together, they'll think you're my girl. And if they get the impression that you're important to me, they'll probably try to rough you up. Or worse. So just stay away from me. Got it? <laughs> what? Are you insane? You think you could take them on? We're talking about a gang here. You wouldn't stand a chance. <laughs> Your funeral. I'll be waiting at the school gate at 3.30. Yep, there they are. Right on schedule. You better leave before... Hey, you're not actually going to try to fight them, are you? They'll kick your ass. <sighs> no turning back now. Here they come. I've... I've never seen anything like that before. You're... not human. <laughs> After today, I definitely won't have to worry about those guys anymore. If you hadn't stepped in, though, they probably would have killed me. I... <laughs> I owe you my life. There's no way I could ever pay you back for what you just did. But... There's someone else who might be able to. My brother. He's got... Connections. You know that street with all the stores? At night, you can find my brother there. In an alleyway. I'll tell him to hook you up with whatever you want. After that, we'll be square. Alright? And hey... Thanks again. I'm not going to give you my name, and you're not going to give me yours. The less we know about each other, the better. As soon as we're done here, you're going to forget my face and forget that this conversation ever happened. Got it? Understood. My brother owes you a debt that he could never repay. I'm grateful that you pulled his ass out of the fire, but that doesn't make us friends. The less debts a man owes, the better. And I don't want my brother to owe anything to anyone. So I'm here to make things square between you and him. This is strictly business, so let's get to the chase. I brought some things with me that you might be interested in. Hurry up and pick the one that you want. There, you got what you wanted. With this, my brother's debt is cleared. Do we have an understanding? We do. Good. 
And if you're smart, this will be the last time you even talk to someone like me. Just one thing about my brother. I want you to... Never mind. Forget I said anything. I'd like to work with you again. I thought I'd made myself clear. I only owed you one favor, and we're square now. I'm not here to ask for a favor. I'd like to pay for your services. You shouldn't get involved with people like me. I already am. <laughs> if you're actually serious about this, you're gonna need some pretty deep pockets. You'd be surprised. We'll see about that. Here's the menu. And no, the prices are not up for negotiation. What if I want you to make someone disappear? You serious? Not what I was expecting to hear. You do know what you're asking for, right? This isn't exactly something you can undo. From the look on your face, I can tell that you're not joking. I'm going to warn you that what you're asking for is pretty expensive. With that out of the way, let's talk business. Give me a name and a face. I'd like to propose a business deal. Better not be a waste of my time. I go to an elite school. My classmates belong to rich families. Families who wouldn't have a problem paying ransom money. I'm listening. If I kidnap a student from a rich family and bring them to you, would you pay me for them? <laughs> Didn't see that one coming. Do you even realize what you're saying? Do you have any idea how risky that would be? But if you could actually pull it off, hmm, it certainly would be lucrative. <sighs> I don't know why I'm sticking my neck out like this, but all right. I'm in. Don't get caught. Pleasure doing business. Who needs to disappear? 